My name is Ayush Jan. I'm in 12-3 at Arden High. I'm currently pursuing chemistry, physics, pure math, and comp studies at the Cape level. I like playing video games. I love to watch and play sports such as football and tennis. I also play the guitar and I play chess as well. What kind of student would you describe yourself as being? I'm very diligent. I very determined. Even if I don't like a subject, I will just quit in it. I'll try my best to get a good grade regardless. So I'm very passionate about my studies. I'm looking to explore the fields of physics and mathematics. I'm not sure exactly what career I will be pursuing yet. We're here today because you would have been awarded six merits at the CXU level. Tell us a little bit more about that. Well, I I was a bit surprised by the results. I expected some of them, others not so much, but of course I'm very pleased with the results. I'm very satisfied. Um, I'm grateful that my hard work has resulted in these great achievements. And these subjects are, are what exactly? The subjects are economics, literature, there's the sciences, physics, chemistry. Um, parents, tell, tell me about your reactions to hearing that your son has oh, been married. Oh, very, very proud. Uh, Ayush has always been an uh, outstanding student all through his, his school career. Uh, you know, but you know, these, these results are absolutely phenomenal. He's, you know, he just um, he, he has tremendous focus on anything he does, you know, not just academics even sports. Um, uh, anything he does, he gives a hundred percent. And the other thing about him is he doesn't let any success fly to his head. So he, he remains humble and focused. And, um, so we're, we're extremely proud of him. I think it's also his approach to studying. He seeks to understand whatever he's doing. So I think he's able to then answer the questions irrespective of however they are posed. And that, I think, is his biggest asset. And that's why he tends to do well. But he's always been a really good student, um, right from prep school to now. And um, we're looking forward to him doing greater things as he comes up. Outside of academics, though, what, what kind of um, son would you describe him as being? Well, he uh, tends to be generally quiet, um, especially on his own, but then he, he turns into a, a, a completely different personality when he's with his sister. Then, then you know, another side of it comes out, and, you know, as a, the same person that, you know, is quiet is, becomes very noisy and, and loud. Um, but, you know, he, he's, he's very caring, very um, kind. Always very considerate, uh, very considerate of you know every everyone in the family. His his grandma. They, uh, it, there's there's real, really the perfect child. You can't really ask for anything more. Yes. yes. Could you tell me um, what keeps you motivated in everything that you pursue? Well, I would just say it's the desire to do my best in everything. I. I don't like failure, I don't think anyone likes failure, so it, it's just that desire to not give less of myself. I know I can do better in everything, so I don't want to let any of my potential go to waste. Any encouragement that you'd have to, I mean, your fellow schoolmates who are here, who would, have, who would also be watching, but um, on a wider scale, other youngsters like yourself, who probably are struggling to accomplish all the things that probably you have accomplished so far? I would say never give up. Always be confident in yourself. There's nothing that's impossible to do. The most important thing you can do is to learn from your mistakes. We all make mistakes, so it's important that we look back, learn from them, and that's, that's the only way to achieve success, is to improve on yourself. So just keep at it and be successful.